We're live. <laughs> hey, everybody. It's me, Mama D. And look, look who I've got with me. I've got Tori. What's going on, everybody? Look, all two people right now, but there'll be a thousand in about two seconds. That's right. They're just going to see us come on. Like, <laughs> yeah, so like, why, why, let's turn up the devil. Okay. <laughs> Did, you... <laughs> no, down now. Did you notice that I changed the uh, profile picture for our group? For getting over the home? I saw that. I did. I saw that. It looks really good. I know. It looks really good. I know. You've done a really, you've done a visit. I have been away for about three weeks. I haven't seen you. And you know what? Know. It's probably why I'm having a shitty time right now. Exactly. Without Mama D in your life, you just like to, you know. It, it just, I shrivel up like a raisin, man. It Ex just sucks. <laughs> it's no good. Oh, it's, no, it's, it's no good, man. It's just not the same. It's just mm. not the same. I actually need this more than they need this on hump day. I just know. To, like, get over when was the last time that I actually had, I needed help getting over this damn hump? It's Two like, weeks ago when you were eating bag of dicks. Oh, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I had a couple of blisters. Did you finish them all? They're all gone. I, I okay. dipped them. They're gone. I, I dipped them in a ranch. I dipped them in Thousand Island. I dipped them in man. That was gross. Yeah, it was, I dipped them. It was good. Nothing mm. wrong with a little dip in your dick. I mean, whatever. <laughs> so, dip it. You know what? This, I got... Um, I went out to the store today, yeah. and I was looking for something specific, and I found Jim Bean Vanilla Whiskey. Mm. Oh, are you serious? Yes. That you know what you need that it's perfect. It's perfect nice day for that. It's it is nice. nice. No, you I've have never. Snow. I've never had it before. Yes, I got snow. I got so much fucking snow. It's not funny. Hey, Scott, happy hump day. <laughs> So much goddamn snow. It's ridiculous. Oh, um, and here we are in California. We finally, we had those. Oh, my God. Okay, so I don't know if you heard about this, but okay, so in California over the weekend, today's what? Today is a Wednesday. Wednesday. So, oh. hey, back, Ashley. We had the highest wind total mm -hmm. blah, in, in, in who knows how long. There's a place called Kirkwood. Yeah, 206 miles an hour. No more than three, but it's like three hours away, if that. Top of the mountain, ever, it's 209 miles an hour, not exaggerating. We have 57 mile an hour, you know. But I'll tell you what, though, every single man that's been blowing that hard in a long time, I bet you have 57 miles an hour, they were pulling down their pants on the street saying, woohoo! <laughs> I haven't I felt this way in a long time. <laughs> oh my God, okay. Um, Everybody in the chat room, uh, we only have two people right now. Um, tell us how the sound is because I'm getting a little choppy here, but it could be just my internet, you know, because now the wind is up here. So it could be oh, my wow. internet. The ascented damn howly wind up here. No, we got we got 60 degrees. It was like six, almost 70 today, I'd say. It was really nice today. Mm. Real nice. Hey, do you know Tim Miley? Tim Miley? Yeah. No, I with, don't. With Marie, the dog? Pontograph for pooches. He's an amazing guy, and he had an amazing dog who passed away in October. Right. And they just finished doing a fundraiser, a uh, two-hour live event, and there'll be a big one coming up soon. Pontograph for pooches. If people don't know. G is breaking up. See, I knew it wasn't me. Is it me? Yep, it's you. How can that be? I don't know. Probably that fire. Are you melting your damn phone again? Okay. <laughs> Oh, I, I'm in my backyard, but I have good reception back here, I thought. Okay, well, Ashley, you, maybe it's just getting up here to Canada, because Ashley says your picture in sounds a little bit choppy. Mine does. Yes. Ooh, I heard a bird. Yeah, we got birds out here. Mine's choppy. I, yeah, I don't know what to say. Yeah. No. Well, so from, for the moment, we'll we'll run with it, and if it's just too choppy, if it well, does, we'll then just I'll... chop you. We'll make you yeah, hang up and just... then call back again, that's all. That's all I'll do. I'll, yeah, I'll be willing to happen. I'll go inside the house. That's fine. No big deal. Okay. But Tim Miley uh, d does a fundraiser for Potograph for Pooches. Um, he's doing a big one. Uh, he's raised over $40,000 for um, animal shelters. Uh, wow. And he's doing one. Well, he just finished one. Uh, the money goes to Silver Muzzle Cottage. It's for senior dogs. Okay. And it was pretty amazing, but unfortunately, they tried to do bring people in on a Facebook Live, and you know, Facebook's gone stupid again. Oh man! Or still, was dumb on Facebook. They're just they're just wrecking it. 
Chip it. Chip pop -pop. Okay, you need to leave because Ashley just said chip chop pop a pop. <laughs> so, right, so get out and come back in. Try it. Bye. I'm alone. <laughs> I don't know what to do with myself. I'm alone. Anyway, so uh, yeah, so if you're into animals, uh, go over and find Potograph for pooches. Donations are always welcome. It goes to Silver Muddles, Muzzle, Silver. Muzzles Cottage. I probably still have that wrong. Um, I can't put links in the chat. It just does not no more. So, Ashley, guess what's coming up? St. Patty's Day. I'll be working with you. <laughs> George got lost. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't I don't do good talking myself. Oops, here it is. How's it better? Any better? I hope it's better. That's oh, all I got. That's all you got. Well, I'm sure we'll find out. We got four people peeping in on us. Yeah, but you're counting me. <laughs> That's you know, and you. That's you're cool. not in the chat room. It only counts people who are watching right. us. Doesn't count ourselves. Oh boy, you know what? I don't know. <laughs> I hope they're nah. watching us. Oh, shit. Well, if they're not, it's, you know, life's a, and so am I, so what the hell. Um, yeah. Do you know what I'm doing for St. Patty's Day? No, hey, Wendy, how you doing? Hey, I am working with Ashley. I'm going to be dressed doing? up in green, yes. I uh, will be doing a little bit of uh, benevol, what do you call it? Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. I can't think of the word in English, that's good. Some benevol, some, some, Ashley, what's the word in English, damn it? <laughs> Thank you, Wendy. Uh, <laughs> Let's just, let's just cut to the chase. I, you know what? What? No, nah, you know what? I just what? cut to the chase for a second. You know, we've had everybody. I don't know what's going on inside the. I'm going, I'm going straight for the jokes. I don't know what's going on in the atmosphere. But is there anything going on with the moons and stuff like that? Because I've been nothing but just a sensitive little man, and I don't understand it. It's been. I've been. I'm. Somebody must know what the hell's going on. Because I, I can't stop. Everything's affecting me. Everything. Everything. Hold on. You know what it, I should do? I, wait, wait, wait. I'll go like this. Every, wait. Everything. It's like, ah, welcome to hell, George. Yeah, except you, you're choppy, so it didn't work. <laughs> uh, is this messed up? Yeah, I, I think you're going to have to go in the house. Get up off your ass and go in the house. Oh, God damn it. All right, I'll go back in the house. Hang Let's on. go in the house. I'm going in the house. Going in the house. I'm going we'll right now. We'll take a tour. We'll take a tour with you. Oh, the house is so clean. <laughs> so nice out. Right. Well, you know, this, I don't know what it is. Me either. So hang on. Maybe it's uh, the winds. The wind blows. Yeah, no doubt. All right, hang on. Okay. It's now cold. It's cold. He had to shut the door. <laughs> it's not cold. I, I just don't want no damn dogs to bug me tonight. Uh, right, hopefully that'll work. Hopefully See? that'll work. Much better. Is it really? Yes. Oh, and Wendy God. says, yes, the moon and there are solar storm solar storms. Little, little, little. Yeah, see, there's something going on because it's just it's a mess right now. It's a mess. Total mess. Yeah. Ashley says, gee, it's not you. It's in there. At least we have each other. <laughs> Absolutely. No, no, that's good. Because I'm just like, I've been just a wreck, man. I've been a total wreck lately. But you know what it is? A week without Mama D, you're a basket case. Oh, and totally. here, okay. Yesterday, I put on my Facebook page. I don't know if you noticed it. Probably did. I think you liked it. Some people liked it. Some people didn't. I don't. Right. When I post on my Facebook page, people, and if I don't comment or like or whatever to your reaction, don't be surprised because I turn off the notifications. Right. So right. when I post something, I post something. It's for you. It's not for me to continue to go, oh, who checked it out and who liked it and whatever. But I posted yesterday that y'all best behave yourselves because you don't want me to open up a camera whoop ass. Oh, I saw that. <laughs> I saw that. No, no. I mean, that's... Yeah, people think that. people think Mama D is very sweet and kind and adorable, and I am all of those things. But you mess with my people, you mess with my friends, you mess with my family. You've crossed a line you do not want to cross. You don't want to see this redhead get angry. Right, right. Mm, it's not so, fun. So how's Ashley going? Ashley's here tonight. She's always she's always here every single week. She uh, I know. 
How she's she addicted doing? to us. Oh gosh, she's she. I I, yeah, I slip her about five bucks in the mail every time she shows up. <laughs> you know, so. Yeah, Ashley says you need your weekly dose of Mama D. <laughs> You know, it might be that. It, it might be that because, I mean, I, I went on Facebook and, and I had a vent the other night. And then today I went on Facebook just to apologize to people because I was just Stop like. The apologies, dude. I know. But you, you know what? Okay. You, you are who you are. No, you don't. Did you insult anybody? No. no. See? Uh, no need to apologize. Mm. You you were being you. You were telling how you felt, what you felt. And the rest of that, the anime. <laughs> Trying not no. to say anything. Misbehaving no. here. No, but, I get you. You know, there are times when I want to, that I just, I just want to, mm, yeah. but I don't, I don't because I did once and I jokingly said I was, re I was having a really bad day and I right. jokingly posted, uh, I think I'm going to taking up drinking as, as a pastime. Right. And I got reamed for that one because <laughs> Mama D is, is watched and followed and loved and that, 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 that. So, like, I don't, but I do, uh, I'll do it, but I'll do it with a smile, and I'll do it so that people don't realize I'm pissy, but right. they'll get the idea that I'm pissy, you know, like, oh, you know, I, don't, I, don't I make get, me up when I put a can of whoop ass on you. <laughs> I get really pissy, you know, my whole thing is I take, like I said today, you know, I just take this Facebook, <sighs> I don't like seeing people getting picked on, I'm just going to keep it real tonight, I, I hate seeing people get hurt, I hate seeing people get upset. You know, Facebook's used for the wrong reasons. And you know what? It's like, let's just say Ashley or myself. No, let's say me because I don't want to bring Ashley into it. That's not right. Let's oh, bring Ashley. No, no, no. Let's say, okay, like, fine, let's do it. Let's say Ashley's having a really shitty day, real bad day. And you know, she gets on Facebook to get away from the world and get away from the, the reality. And you jump on Facebook, you do what you got to do, and then all of a sudden somebody chimes in there that doesn't like Ashley and says something negative about Ashley. See, that's the stuff that I, I don't like because, you know, you don't know what people are going through. So that's what happened to me the other day. Somebody was getting picked on. Of course, mm -hmm. George with the super kid had, had to jump on and say what he had to say. And I was not happy about it. You know, I don't like people that are mean to other people. It's it's just not cool. It's it's not cool. No, it yeah. is. And and the thing is, some people don't. Some people are like, no, 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 I don't give a shit what anybody says. And and I get that. You know, yeah. people have no no filter sometimes, right. and they don't. And it's not that they don't understand, but they don't give a flying frog's behind if they insult anybody or not. Well, the problem is, is is people don't realize that you and I and Ashley and whoever may show up tonight or or may watch this later. These are when real people. What, these are real people, mm -hmm. and we're and it, and the problem is people don't take it so serious. They get on the keyboard, they jump on Facebook. Oh, I'll just talk crap to this person. Yeah, and it's like you're messing with people. These are people. Their hearts are beating. Their lungs are breathing. You know, they they these are people that are actually on this have the same exact direction of getting on Facebook, having a good time, and just let just putting the world outside and leave it outside and get on Facebook for 15, 20 minutes to get away and vent mm -hmm. or just to chat with somebody, somebody that'll listen. Like I know I can run to you anytime I want. Yeah. If I'm having a bad day. I'm well, I'm going to call mama D, you know, because she'll listen, you know? So just don't call uh, me at midnight. And I'll be like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> no, this guy, you know, this guy's been crashing out. I go to bed early. I'm in bed by, yeah. Cause you nine, own. <laughs> I'm, shit. Yes. <laughs> no, it's because you work for a living. Er, Ashley yeah. puts in the in the chat room. Hey, you were being real. You said what others are feeling. It can break you down, wear you down, and sometimes enough is enough. Enough's that's enough. It. Enough is enough, and that's that's, that's the thing. Enough. That's it. No hey, Candy. Okay, oh, what Candace, else? what's going on, Candace? How you doing? She's a God, She's another star. Another rock star. I'm you know? I'm I'm hoping that I can talk her into coming on my other show, my Sunday, my real, sh my show where I get serious ish. <laughs> right, right. Oh, it's yeah. There's you know that's the whole thing about you know Wednesdays when we do this. It's it's it's. It's all no about having fun, and yeah. yes, we do have moments where we vent, and you like you know, yeah. and and I like I knew this was bothering you, and yeah. I make you smile. I val Ashley says I value you both. You bring real value to our community of friends and listeners. Thank you very much. Yeah, that's, that's, but we don't that's do it. this for you guys. We do it for ourselves. Yeah, it's not about you guys. It's about us. But, you know, that's the whole thing. Though. It, what makes it really nice, it makes it, you know, it, it, and this is not the show about George. It's just the show about people just need 
to understand that these are real people out there. And I can't stress enough. It breaks my heart so many times during a day to see so many people being hurt by people's keyboard bulliness. Yeah. You know, and Sorry, it's, it's, I just had a happy moment. I just realized I can now type in this chat room. Yes. <laughs> well, go ahead and chat. Uh, go ahead and type all you want, girl. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. I won't. Oh. Scott or <laughs> Scott says star S star 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 stirs are all over Facebook. Facebook. I have no idea what that S word is. What What does that mean? I don't know. <laughs> ah, shit, I don't know. <laughs> tell us, Scott. Tell us. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah, so I'm glad no, everybody's... Go ahead. Some people just ask hats, and, and you just sort of kind of got to let them... Uh, some people can't handle seeing the happiness and love we f share freely. They are hurting, and they want you. They want to hurt others, and it isn't personal, but it feels like it. You Ashley's know, I, I think that's right. Who said that? Ashley? Ashley's, yeah, you know what? Ashley's right on... I, she's 100% right. There's different mm -hmm. answers to all this stuff going on. She's... She's seriously 100% right. If anybody sees Ashley or myself or you, Mama D, or anybody else that listens, and they see us, oh, my God, this guy or girl is having a great day. Why? Well, that's not fair. So I'm going to go ahead and just – I'm going to make them feel like shit. I'm just going to bring them down because I don't like that they're so happy. And, you know, it's just – that's the problem. People just need to, like, be happy and celebrate people are happy. And, you know, karma is good karma. It'll come around and get you. And, it'll mm -hmm. be, you know, it'll be your turn next. That's all. So it, it also know. depends on how you look at things. You know, yeah. if you look for stupid shit on Facebook, yeah. you're going to find it. Oh, but okay. I do my do my best to make sure I post um, nothing but happy, well, not all happy, yeah. like, you know, certain right. silly things go on. But it still makes you smile. I post a card of the day. Who knows when it's going to pop on the thing. Um, I have a friend in New Zealand, and he takes pictures and, and whatnot when he walks around. So I get a flower of the day from him. So today was a, a beautiful red flower with a bumblebee, and I called it the bumblebee. Uh -huh. You know, it's just, yeah. it's something. And I know there's some people out there go, my God, has she ever shut up? Does she ever not be happy? Yeah, I do not be happy, but I don't do it on Facebook. And if you right. do, if I do do it on Facebook, you are not going to be amazed. You are, you don't yeah. want to see it. It's not no. there. Now. No, but you know, that's, that's, see, that's my problem is I, once I get to my, if, if the wick is, is you like the wick, like on a firecracker, mm -hmm. once I'm fired up about something, I, I just, I get, I just, I lose control. And I don't mean it. I cry. When I get angry, I cry. And this I is cry. not a pretty face when it cries. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. It's no, like no, what no. Are I agree with you, but I think what you know, there's two people here. You and I right now chop up. We're talking about crying and stuff. I assure you, there's thousands of people who are exactly like us, and we, you know, there's on a daily basis, you know, something that makes you so upset, and, and you cry. I cried the other day. It was just I was so upset, but it's just uh, because I care about people. I I, I, I care about people. <clears throat> you know. I know. I, I know. know. I know. So I'm ready for so, the okay. Yeah. Oh, so you're God. ready for the summer? Did you did you want to see how much snow I got out there? Just wait. I'm gonna take a picture of it tomorrow. Is it? Is it <gasps> yeah. We got. I'm wearing shorts to work, t-shirt. Today was uh, tennis shoes and socks and you know boxer shorts. Where it, and it's comfortable because it's so hot outside. It's so nice. I know the picture, right? It's boxer <laughs> shorts. <laughs> I, I'm an open book, man. They were blue today. I wore blue boxer okay. shorts. Yeah. I don't care. It's like, does George or boxers or brief? He said boxers so many times. I got to be boxers. 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 Right. You got you to let things. You got You know what? Don't let me start. Don't make me start. You know? Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. Okay. Start him. No, I just realized I didn't share the. Well, somebody. Uh, Wendy said, I believe she said she shared. Ashley shared. Scott shared. Let's get this thing going. We need to have fun. People oh, yeah. need to know that we're here because I, we're not going back to my Facebook page. I know I have a lot of people to follow me on Facebook, but you all get your asses over here. <laughs> right, but you know, but you know, I know that the numbers don't mean shit to me. It, it's not about for me. It's not. I, I don't. You know what I like is the Ashleys and the Candice and the people that that every, you know. And there's more people, of course, but the ones you see them all the time here mm -hmm. and outside of here. They'll, they'll, they're always so kind and lovable. Yep. So. Uh oh. No, no, it's a kitty cat. Oh, no, it's the cats. No, there's, there's the, the, the all. Uh, Scott said, "All good." G love the realness. 
It's, it is. It's real. I appreciate that, man. And that's that's the problem, though. Everybody, because it's Facebook, people want to be fake. It's got it's Facebook, not fake book. And oh you know, you got you know, just be you. And if someone doesn't like you for you, then then the move who's on. over there. Who's over there? That was my daughter. She's she still doesn't want. She still doesn't want to come on camera, right? No, she won't okay. do it. Man. She won't okay. do it. Okay. Yeah. Candace in the chat room says people have tried to bully me through my life for epilepsy. A fucking asshole. Sorry. Wow. <laughs> I would always tell people I was made special. You may like me, you may not. I am who I am. I'm not changing because I'm happy to be me. That's exactly. your problem for bullying me. Very true. No, it's I don't. True. Yeah. I think we all got a certain amount of bully. I used to get bullied because I had red hair. Please. Right. Now people chase after me to go, is that real? Can I right. it? Yeah, it's tough to go ahead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. It's, you know what? I, it's, it, and it's only gotten worse. You know, it's, it, it's, it's, it happens everywhere. Mm -hmm. It happens oh, everywhere. Oh, yeah, it does. And the thing is, people don't, people, everybody gets bullied. Mm -hmm. And the person, the person that's bullying you, somewhere along the way, he's being bullied or she's right. being bullied. Right. You know. So right. I don't, I don't, I don't go back on a person like. I'll just sort of let them vent, mm -hmm. you know, because that's my thing. I'll let you vent. I'll let you have your moment of spew that nasty, evil shit, get it out of you. And when right. you're done, I'll be like, "You done now? Thank you very much. Have a nice day." You know, well, and if, if they leave, great. If they don't, thank you. And yeah. if they don't, well, then I can make sure that they leave. Right. No, there you go. Well, there's, you know, there's a side of me, like some people too. I'm sure people like this. I shut down. It depends where I'm like, I'll shut down and disappear. And it just, it, it's like a light switch. Yeah, but come. you forget, you forget I have your phone number. I, I know, that's true. <laughs> no, but I do. I shut down. I, I just shut down. I mean, you know, I, I'm, I, yeah, I just shut down. You know, that's just my way because I don't want to get, I don't want to get mad, you know, so. No, because it, shutting down is, is the simplest way of not losing who you are. Mm -hmm. You have to, some people have to shut down just to, for the sake of not allowing the, the anger and frustration to get away with themselves. Mm -hmm. you know? Exactly. And exactly. when do you... Yes, Candace, sexy red hair. I love red hair. <laughs> I can't remember which side it is. Um, can, Wendy got bullied because of her glasses in school. I, hello, yeah. you know, we people will bully you for 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 simple things because because a they don't understand b whether they admit it or not it's a form of jealousy they're jealous yeah. of the peace that yeah. you have of of the the you know like you you just you know like I rock my glasses I don't care what people say you know it's like hello I want to mess with people I just do this <laughs> <laughs> yeah no and I well, there's, you know, but, you know, back to, to, I mean, it looks like we're talking about bulliness, but, you know, it, on Facebook, the bullies, it's not more so bully. It, it's, they're saying stuff that's very hurtful. There's one thing being at school, you get bullied, hey, give me your milk money. Give me your milk money or I'm going to make you skip the bus or something like that. But on Facebook, you get people that just hide behind the keyboards and they say things that is just not cool. Yeah. It's just yeah. not cool. But the know? thing is, I think those people, um, Okay, hold on, quick one. Uh, George, hibernation is good sometimes to refresh. That's from Candice. Yeah, she's right. And Ashley has a question, and yes. we'll get to that in a second. And sure. sometimes I, Wendy takes breaks from Facebook. Now, I don't know how to take breaks from Facebook. I just love you people too much. Besides, I'm all alone. I nobody go drive people crazy. Well, that's she's right though. I've tried to take a break, but the other day I said that's it. Thirty day. I'm getting my thirty day notice on Facebook. I'm out. I'm out of here. I've been. I, I got it. It lasted for one day I, I slept through the night and i said you know what i need my I, it, what it is is i need the candaces i need the mama d's there's people out there that i need in my that can't I, there's people i need on facebook that mm -hmm. I, it just it just it just i need it, it is what it is so yeah and the thing is it you don't i mean yes i come on facebook we'll just do a quick question question from ashley is what would you what would your perfect day look like <laughs> Sitting at home in his backyard with his fireplace going. Hey, Travis, what's up? My perfect day is work. My perfect day would be staying home and just working on the yard, even if it Did doesn't. Did you see need his it. perfect weekend? He's got white picket fence, a nice it, pathway. Yeah, I just got I'm gonna done hire him and bring him up here. Ashley, don't you need work done in the yard? <laughs> Any anytime. But that's my that's my but that's my therapy. That's my perfect. I put my headphones on. I listen to some country music. And I'll, and I'll just work. And it just puts me in a different world. 
You know? Do you know that there was a, a, a survey done? It was posted on Facebook that there was a, a hand with, with dirty hand that had dirt on it and it says that there's it, there's a, there's been a study that that gives you good energies. Like seriously, people, you had to actually waste money to do that as a study when you could have just asked any, you know, empath. So Whatever and just what, dirt on your hands? Like stick your hands hand? in the dirt. Go work in a garden. Go work on the, whatever. Getting that into sense. Mother Nature is is like a major yahoo. That makes total sense. It yeah. really, you know, five years ago, I'd say that that sounds stupid. But you know what, though, I, I get you. you're absolutely hundred percent right. Though now that I'm where I'm at in my life now with this with paranormal or just the the, the energy and the, from people like you, Mama D, you give me this energy that's like. Oh my God! You know, there's days when I, 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 it is what it is. You know, but yeah. I, I, I think you're right there. You put your hand in the dirt, and, and you know, who knows? And for a thousand years, who's walked on this the dirt that I just scooped up in my hand? So exactly, uh, exactly. I think you're right. I think and you're when right. it's and when it's not snowy and freaking cold outside, you can go. I can go out underneath the stars. Jeez, when does the snow disappear in Canada? <sighs> not soon enough. <laughs> Are you serious? Uh, really? Is it that bad? Yeah. Well, you know, snow winter happens twice a year, right? At the beginning of it and at the end of it. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. January, that's, February, March, and April. Right. See, that's and then right now. October, November, December. So it's like six months of freaking winter. And it's complete snow. I mean, you just guys, that's it for those. That's it's that. Ugh. Well, some years we start later with the snow. This year we start a little later. I can remember one year we had a. We had a brown Christmas, hoo ha! Right. Yeah, <laughs> and all the kids were all disappointed. I was like, yes. <laughs> now, now it's like I got like the snow that has just fallen is about waist high. My God! Yeah, I, I, I and I complain I'll you on. I'll send you geez. something. Yeah, no, you can no, no. yeah, this is a great weather. And Travis in, is in the chat room. Hey, Travis, he says he spends one hour on Facebook now, and that's with us. Well, you know, Travis, you know, we actually have a rule now at the house is, is we shut off our phones. Well, I used to get home 5, 30, 6 o'clock from work, uh, and then I, I'm on Facebook for one hour and a half, the longest. And we said that we shut down at 7.30 at night because normally we sit on the couch, watch our shows, commercial, oh, let's look on Facebook. Now I jump off it. I just, I have to turn it off. It's, it's just, well, it's then, not. Then I'll just send you a text message on your phone. <laughs> <laughs> on Facebook. Shit, man. George, I, I, how are you? Well, I, I will George, turn, make I George turn, for me. <laughs> no, 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 I turn, you have my you have my direct number, though. That's different. Yep. And Kara's yeah. too. Oh, do you? Yeah, so see, if you don't answer me, I'll, I'll miss George. No, <laughs> no, no, no. You No, you can call anytime. That's different. But Facebook can just be it's been absorbing my life too much. It really has. But here's the thing, and 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 I know it's it's like, yeah, waste time. Uh, here's the thing. I know that Facebook has a lot of negatives to it, but look at all the positive. And and you got all pissy the other day because you saw bullying going on and it just aggravated you and it frustrated you. But do you know how many people that helped? Seeing you get angry and frustrated and spewing, you actually yeah. help people with that. I mean, it may not be great for you, but it actually helps somebody. I, you know what I hope is I hope that, you know, thank you, Mama D. You know, what I do hope is it did don't, help okay, people. Here's, here's, here's a word wording thing. You don't hope anymore. You have faith. Okay. You I have, have faith you help. You have faith that whatever. Don't hope. Because hope gives the option for negatives. Right, you have faith right. that it's going to happen. Well, I, oh, God, I'm gonna make, I don't, don't want to misword it now. Um, <laughs> I'll fix it for you. No problem. <laughs> okay. So I'm not going to say hope, but I, I feel that maybe because of god damn it forget it. i can't even say it right but you know what i'm not even trying. but you know I, I i do realize after i woke up the next morning after i vented that there was a, a handful of people that were and i wasn't looking for somebody to say no you got to come back i was more so looking for i needed i needed to feel love there you go and i is i just needed to feel love and you know what if anybody says they don't like feeling loved then I, let me show you let me tell you something you're wrong um, yeah. when i woke up the next morning and people are like saying what they had to say it was just my turn to feel love because i send love out to everybody every single day yep so i it felt good to come back and it circle it was really cool it's like life life is like this circle it's a circle of trust and circle and it came back in 24 hours and it felt so good because i all yeah. i want to do every day is honestly 
touch someone's heart and touch someone that's basically like having a bad day and, and helping that one person. And that's it, man. Yeah. That's all we do. Do, do, do. Ashley. Ashley's pretty vocal today. I like do you it. know that do you know that next time that you can't make it, Ashley has agreed to come on and be my co-host? Oh, Ashley, that's I, I still want to see how somehow we get three people on here. Man. I know, but as you can see, my internet is kind of kind of sort of yonky. Well, so. That's all right, man. I'll go but, find somebody who's got really good internet. It's not with Ma Bell, that's for sure. Sorry. Well, uh, <laughs> Ashley uh, says, gee, others are feeling what you vocalized and it validated other people's feelings. There is there was value in what you said. I appreciate that. And, and Ashley, thank you so much. And that, and it's just, you know, I, I haven't been the smartest, brightest person all my life, but, you know, it, I, 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 I've earned my stripes and I feel like the, the stuff that I say does matter. I, I think I'm always trying to help, not trying to not help. And I appreciate that, Ashley. I really do. You know, and, you know, I have to say to Mama D, you know, it's, you know, she's helped me, you know, and it's just one of those situations. I cuss you out. <laughs> I, I seriously no but you've helped me you know you, you it's just one of those things where i can come here on wednesdays when i can make it and i'm and that's i'm glad i'm here tonight and it's able to just reach out to one or two people it's it's just amazing it's a great yeah. feeling well i know we've talked about moving the show to another day yeah and and Whew. i mean yeah it sounds great but this yeah. is hump day Get I over know. the home. This I is know. what we're about. This is what people look forward to. Ashley will be like messaging me. Are you guys having a show tonight? Yes, dear. <laughs> yes, dear. Oh, I was jamming, man. Yeah. I'm telling you, Ashley, I get off work kind of late and it's uh I jet now. now you I can just, I, you can do this from the car. Figure out a way to put your phone up on your on your thing. You don't have to look at you could be driving home with the phone up on the dashboard and just talking to us. And that'd be, that, you'll be fine. Just hear your voice. That's actually a really good idea. Yes. I didn't, God, I didn't we're going to hear road rage. God damn it, get out of my way. <laughs> You'll see the real me as I drop it into fifth gear. I'm like, get the fuck out of my way. He's got a fancy white car. God, get out of my way, man. I'll run over you. Why not? Yeah. I mean, when the weather gets nicer that was and, cool. and the summertime, I can go sit out on the back porch and do this. Well, I found out that I can't because there's no I can't, reception. No, I can't. Yeah, no, I can't because I need the laptop to do it. So, man. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Perfect. Uh, Candace has said she's willing to come on a Sunday with me. Yes. She's now, what are you doing? Amazing. Wait, so, how many shows you got? Well, how many shows I got you got? two. I got this one with you. Right, right, right. And, and I got Sunday's uh, conversation with friends. That's when I first had you on. <laughs> All right. yeah, and that that's fine. where we just did. We figured this one out. Yeah. Um, I have been asked to do a co hosting sometimes on another show. It, that still needs to be discussed. I, I'm not sure exactly. You know, and and it doesn't interfere with my shows. I've been a guest on shows. I have fun. I enjoy doing this. I enjoy sharing my message. I enjoy listening to what other people have to say. And you know, Ashley says the Lion King. It's the circle of life. There we go. There is. And, excuse me. Wait one second, Travis. You got to stop. The, just like I told George. Why did you stop posting your videos? Because he doesn't post his workout videos anymore. He just takes a picture when he's done. Screw the picture when you're done. Post the workout video. Just seems if you like my son used to do that, doesn't do it anymore because now all I get videos is of my grandbaby. But post videos of you lifting the weights and even if you're some other hunky chunky and <laughs> even if you're sitting on the toilet, man. Just no, don't do that. Doing. That's only George can do that. <laughs> he's gonna make poor growth for JF. You know what? I did that to my buddy over the weekend. Uh, uh, his name is Andrew Moraro, I think his last name. He lives right here. It was his birthday on Saturday. And I didn't want to forget his birthday. So I said, screw up. First thing in the morning, I went to sit on the throne. And I put my phone about 10 feet away. And I dropped my drawers. I dropped them. I just went with my business. Dropped them. And I just said, happy <laughs> birthday, buddy. Happy birthday. I didn't care. I had no, I had no, I just, I, there was no damage. It was just, I just sat down. I like, hey, what's up? And he was like. You got to be fucking kidding me. You did not just do that. I, who are you gonna tell, Andrew? He's a good guy. Man. You just you just did you just put your business out there all on Facebook? I don't care. And that's what's so funny. I I I, I good. Don't care. Good. Is what it is. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, quick one. I'm gonna do a little bit of promo for, for StreamYard, okay? If you know of anybody who's doing a show, uh, I saw it happen earlier today. They want to do a Facebook Live. They want to bring people on. Facebook will not allow you to have people come on anymore. Don't know why Facebook's gone all PMSy. I don't know. But get 
post ice cream or candy and get yelled at. Oh, don't even start that. <laughs> <laughs> Scott put a picture up of, of three ice cream cones on on his on his Instagram. I was like, hey, that is so not fair. Right. <laughs> Sorry, had a moment. Ice cream. Okay, but <laughs> if you know somebody who wants to do a show, look up StreamYard. S share the StreamYard. It is an amazing platform. You could have. Look at if my internet was smart enough, I could have six people on here. Everybody that's in the chat room now could be on this label, on this show with us. But like, That'd be internet, bad. Uh, you know, don't. That'd be do, cool. And and the thing is, people go, well, I have nothing to say. Everybody has something to say. Everybody. Let me tell you something. I remember my first, my very first Facebook live, my very first one. I remember it, and it was I was pissing my pants i was like i didn't know what to do i got them all hi how's it going out there and i'd shut up no, i wouldn't know what to say i gotta find that i gotta find that one. Oh god it was it was so bad it was so i but i didn't know what i was doing i just i got on it and and i was a dork man but you know what we all have to start somewhere it, it's it's just all you do is it, it's exactly. fun now it's fun now I, I just i have a good time and it's and i and the more you do it and it's not about but the more you do it, the more people you get that'll just listen. And and it's sometimes it's just fun. Now. I love the people that show up. It's just fun. Mm -hmm. so. Candace says, George, love it when Kara caught you pinching your nipple with a cable. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> His uh, wife told him how to, he needed to get grounded and she never explained. That's to him. all it was. <laughs> man. I, was just, I was just trying, you know, I was, my energy was low. I was trying to ground myself. I locked myself in the bathroom. I had my jumper cables on. And I, you know what's funny is, and this is no jokey joke, is <laughs> I'm so stupid that I had it plugged in and I unplugged it. But what happens is that thing, that battery holds a charge. I wasn't thinking. And I'm not going to, I'll tell you exactly what happened. I actually got nipple charged. And I'm telling you right now that, I unplugged it. It wasn't plugged in, but that thing holds the charge for, for like we have a, a power outage. I seriously, I'm telling you right now, people, I almost lost a fucking nipple. I'm telling you right now. And I, I was freaking out because the next, I'll, look at, I'll tell you, like, let's just let, go ahead and just fuck with George tonight. So here it is. I've, I've, I've over nared my body one day. I was nearing my chest because I'd go to the gym or whatever. And I got nair, girls nair stuff on my nipples. The next morning, my nipples were about as hot as red as Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer's nose, I thought I was dying. And you, so I have respect about Nair. So something to do with my... So that being said... He likes is, messing with his nipples, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Lord. It was one of those... They're my sensitive... They're my antennas. So, But I actually, with that battery cable thing, no, I, I almost lost a nipple. I almost <laughs> lost a nipple. It, it was scabbed up for about a week or two. So I got, it was no joke, man. It was no joke. So, <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> you know what? That's, that was funny back then. But for three, but I would, I, when I went to the gym, I couldn't, I would not wear a tank top because I, it was like crispy brown. It was so crispy. <laughs> it was so bad, man. But so I didn't know it was going to tell charges and it did. And oh, dude, seriously. Okay, Travis says he went ghost hunting last Friday. Had a lot of fun. Was at a bar that was owned by Al Capone. Wow. Wow, that's great. I heard about Travis. Travis is, Travis is a you know Travis. Travis Enright is a good guy. He really is a good guy, and yeah. it's nice to see him getting deeper in the paranormal field because he's actually he has a really good friend, uh, Ron uh, Henrik or Henrik. Oh, I, I'm gonna I'll chop it up, and uh, they are two good paranormal investigators. I think they work well together. So what it's worth well we should get them on the show one time oh he's you, should, you should make them do a facebook live. no you don't do this thing you need to do this thing oh travis we need to teach george how to do things properly i don't know how to, i don't know how to do it, it, it you, I don't know how to do but you need you need a laptop you, need a laptop. Oh, I don't have a laptop. Care you have to ask the wife if you can borrow her laptop yeah that probably should because it's yeah, that would be fun you know just to chop it up with people yeah and I love you know me though. I love I'll talk. It doesn't matter, man. I'll talk about anything. It does from I mean, come on. I just I just let people know of half a million people. Yeah, I fried my nipples about four months ago. <laughs> well, you do realize that when we finish this show, 
I take the, the, the MP4 of it and just put the audio and upload it to an, an audio site that goes to, uh, what is it, um, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Spreaker, uh, all those, you know, like there's like five or six different places. So now my, my entire following will know that my co-host fried his nipples. <laughs> I did, man. It sucked. I, you know, I, listen, let's, let's just keep the subject about nipples. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't even matter. I've actually, almost, I've actually, when I was shaving, I'm, you know, I'm telling the whole world, uh, shaving. You know, I shaved my body. I'm manscaped, whatever. And I got too close in the shower, had bubbles all over me, and whatever. And I just went, and I shit you not, I had gushes of blood going down. I'm thinking, what the fuck? Just excuse me. And I literally <laughs> took out my nipple. I, I was like, it grew back. It grew back longer than the other one, but it grew back. <laughs> You know, I just don't have. I have no shame. You have, have no, no shame, shame. but the, you know what? It's okay because you 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 can laugh at yourself, and that's uh, the I, best part. You can laugh at yourself, and you don't care if people laugh at you because they're not really laughing at you. They're laughing at <laughs> I you. I, I laugh at you. I don't mind. It's shit. okay. I don't yeah, care. Yeah, but I'm me. Man. Hello, I can I can laugh at anybody if they have a problem with it. Too bad. Yeah, no, no, no. It's it, it is what it is, man. I went to the doctors today. How, what'd they say? What are you finally going? Are you going to go back to? I'm death? off for an indeterminate amount of time. What does that mean? Means that? when I get more tests done, they're going to check and see. Wow. So, so for right now, I can I can only stand for like three hours max. See, that's that's yeah. uh, how long you been? How long you been out for now? <sighs> Since June third. That's a long time. And unfortunately, we have a really great hospital situation where it pays a lot of bills. You know, it's really great. But I have to wait for an ultrasound, which could take up to six months. So wait a second. I, now, I, I do know the story, what happened. But are you able, do you guys have, well, of course you have this. Is it, are you on workman's comp? No. Um, work, workman's, I, it, it would have been workman's comp if I had done it at work. But no, yes. I went grocery shopping. That's right. Okay. Yes. So is, are you on like are you able to collect state disability or anything? Like I that? I collected I collected uh what's known as um uh, disability unemployment. Okay. But that yeah. only lasted 15 weeks. But luckily through my company I paid for insurance. Good and girl. they have long-term disability which kicked in at 17 weeks. So for a couple of weeks I was like oh, I'm starving to death. No, I wasn't. Right. But no, you know, no. but sense. now I still I have a great and and my caseworker she's an amazing person uh -huh. she's you know she's great she calls me up and, and gives me an update and i i couldn't get a hold of her today to give her the update on what was what and so the <laughs> the poor young woman who answered she goes we you do realize we have 48 hours to get back to you i said sure as long as she doesn't call me at midnight and she kind of uh -huh. went <gasps> and she started to laugh i said yeah there you go right wow. i know so yeah you so i am i am I am still not working driving other people crazy so I will be here driving you crazy. No, that's okay but are you, aren't you missing it by cuz I would be just mm, Yes. I would be just going yes. crazy. Yeah. And the thing is I don't drive, right? I don't drive. I drive people crazy but I don't drive a vehicle. Right, so right. I'm stuck at home because for me to get into the village it's a 45 minute walk and I'm not walking. Snowmobile. And you guys take a snowmobile or do you ride the polar bear in? I mean, what do you guys have in Canada? I mean, is it like Huskies? Gotcha. I got quick chocolate. Hey, that or I have I, friends. Yeah, no, I could. You know, I couldn't do it, man. Did you notice? Like, uh, Ghost Hunters was just filming up in uh, Alaska, and they were, I don't know. There's a guy. I, I don't know his last name. Daryl, uh, Ghost Hunters, and they were up in Alaska, and they looked cold. It was all snow. It yep. was like hell no. Yeah. Mm -hmm. no I will. We'll see what the weather is. Uh, if it's not too cold, because tomorrow's supposed to be like minus 20 something, I have no idea what. Oh my God, don't even say that. My, <laughs> seriously, are you serious? Is it that cold? Well, it, it does get that cold sometimes. Uh, wait, wait, no, 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 no. This, I, I, Celsius, not Fahrenheit. Celsius. Let's go to, wait, let's go to commercial for a second. Time out. So, <laughs> so degrees wise, what's the lowest it's been recently? The lowest at nighttime while you're sleeping? Uh, don't know. Okay, so does it get to like let's say zero degrees Celsius? Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, but I don't get that, man. That's 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 we're, crazy. We're in Canada, that, baby. What's that? We're in Canada. <laughs> I just I don't get it, man. Because I know I, I does see I I'm I'm a penny pincher, but when it comes to like let's say you're you I know we have PGE, 
you know, uh, gas and electric, whatever. Mm -hmm. And our, and like we got a, we got a, our heater bill or, or PG and E bill was for the month was let's say four hundred dollars. I think it was four oh four, and it was because we used the heater because I don't like I don't like being cold. So I kept it at seventy four, and I got my ass kicked by Kara because I had it set for seventy four and she didn't know it. Let me get this bill. Or open it up. Oh, look you what you win. No, four hundred dollars later because I'm thinking. We don't have to pay for that stuff. I, I, oh, yeah. I thought it was free. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. no. So, okay. But, yeah. the, t t tonight? Is it tonight? No, that's tonight. T t t it's going down to minus 24 Celsius. Oh, my God. See that? <laughs> Hold on. Let's find out what that is in Fahrenheit. Oh, that's uh, Celsius. Yeah. Celsius to Fahrenheit. Celsius. Do, 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 do. Minus twenty four is a minus is minus eleven Fahrenheit. Okay, so punch in Brentwood, California. Uh, Come on, you can find weather it. Weather in Brentwood, California. Yes. You're seven degrees. Seven Celsius. What? So what's the other one, Fahrenheit? Then uh, so double it, which is fourteen, and add thirty. So thirty. Forty-five. Wow! Right now we're forty-five. Wow, that's kind of terrible. Roughly? That's just crazy. Yeah. No, I don't like being cold though. I, I mean, I. Uh, uh. I, I, I'm like on the couch. I'll watch my shows or whatever for like an hour before I go to bed. But I call it the cocoon. I wrap myself up in blankets. I don't like being cold. Well, all. hey, you you figure with the temperature that we've had, I've actually gone. Um, uh, with no electricity for 24 hours in the middle of oh. winter. It went out one day, it went out at 1130 in the daytime mm -hmm. and it stayed out to 1130 the next day. Oh, wow. I spent, the only thing I complained about was that I lost power on my phone because <laughs> I had data. So I was cool, but there's no power, no boost, you know, and um, it was cold. I just laid in bed, just wrapped up in bed and I'm good. See you later. Night night. We are so, we are so, we are so addicted to our phones that we, I, I'm the same way. I, I mean, this is, you know, when it comes to, I used to have a flip phone for like a long time and then finally I got this phone app that I'm using now. I'm looking for my phone. You know what I just did? I'm looking for my phone. I go, where's the phone at? Oh, shit, I'm using it right now. <laughs> I'm like, whatever. But no, I mean, I can't live without my phone. It has everything. It has everything that I need. Everything. Ashley, tomorrow's weather. Ashley's got an appointment tomorrow in the village and she walks. Tomorrow's weather during the day is a minus three. <sighs> God dang. Not too bad. In, in snow. Celsius. In, in snow. Yeah. She's got to walk in snow, yes. She doesn't have a polar bear no. like she could ride on? No. Damn. <laughs> he goes to work. A couple of, maybe a couple of penguins. I mean, they can pull you down the street. I mean, I'm picturing this whole thing like, you know, like, like Santa Claus, like Santa Claus lives around the corner for you guys. And, you know, and it's just like, I'm picturing it just freaking cold, man. I can't do it, Ashley. I can't. I can't. Okay. Ashley says, oh, yeah. Wait a second. Um, we were out for 60 hours a few months ago, and we had no propane. We had to dress in our winter gear and play with our kid in a blanket fort. Wow. See, that's where, you know what, that's just, I have lost more respect for you and Ashley. And everybody else that lives out there with in the snow, it's just. Scott wow. says, 67 Fahrenheit in my house, bring a coat. <laughs> <laughs> no, in '67 we'd be in our shorts, dude. So where's he? No, where's this gentleman? I have. I, you probably said Scott is in Rhode Island, I think. It was Rhode Island? Wow, I've never been there. I'd like to go there too. Candace says I'm freezing at 70 degrees, below 60 degrees, and I'm swearing. <laughs> Shoot, man! Wow, this world is so big, and we all have different things we have to deal with. And it's just, I, it's just. Well, just think down in Australia, it's summertime already. Is it really summertime? It's right summertime. Now? They're reverse to us. Wow. That's where my friend who, who sends me the flower, the pictures of the flowers, he's in mm -hmm. New Zealand. And it's like, hee hee. Wow. Ashley says, I am from the West Coast where it rarely snows <laughs> and has been an adjustment for sure. Where, where in the West Coast is she from? I have to she, she, she's the West Coast of Canada. I'm thinking West Coast of California. No, <laughs> not everybody's a George, okay? 
No, they no that would be. It. That it would be. I would never move to freaking Quebec if I lived in Quebec in in California. Right. Well, that's see, that's what's so cool about back to the old thing about Facebook. You know, we all come from different parts of the country, or I'm sorry, the world. Yeah. And it's it's just so cool that you know I'm sitting here in California. You're sitting, you know, over there in, in Canada, and you know we live in. It's just it's just it's so cool that Ashley's from Vancouver Island. You guys have an island out there too. I swear to God, you need to go back to school and get your geography shit on track. Oh, Lord. So, okay, where are the other people that you, like, okay, I have friends in, in the UK. Uh -huh. I, have, I have my bestest, bestest friend, because she's allowing me to retire there, is in Trinidad. Right. Um, I got you in the States. I got, like I said, eventually when I hit the lottery, I'm going yeah. to get a Winnebago. Right. My daughter's going to drive because I can't drive. We're going to put our dogs in. I'm leaving the husband at home. Put our puppies in, and we're going to drive. We're going to drive across Canada because people want to meet me there. I don't know why. Then I have to sneak across the border because some people in the States want to meet me. And then I'm going to go over, chitty, chitty, bang, bang it over to the UK. And then I'm going to retire in Trinidad. Chitty, chitty, bang, bang. Oh, my God. I love it. That was perfect. Well said. Well said. Travis says, I'm used to cold weather. Sometimes I only wear a T-shirt if I... If it don't get below zero, Travis, well, come play in the snow out here. There's a lot of snow. You ain't getting that cold weather in a t-shirt yet. Though, yeah. mind you, I do have where I work. I had a customer who come in rain, snow, middle of winter, pit, pit de neige, a, a snowstorm. He, he wore shorts. He was a crazy redheaded burly dude that you know was the truck driver. Was right. he a truck? He wasn't truck driver. He worked on a construction crew and he worked. And his boss. Wanted him to wear pants. This guy wore shorts. Wow. Before, was he a big fella? Was he a big fella? He was he was burly, you know. He wasn't yeah. fat or nothing, but he was no, burly, no, no. you know. Yeah. And he had this old beard going on. I said he was a crazy redhead because he was. But you know, his bosses used to say, no, you can't wear shorts. In in he worked cranes. Wow. And they took him to they took him to the union or whatever. And the union said, What are you touched? The man he's yeah. wearing he's wearing steel toe boots. That's what you want to wear. And he's Driving a grain, he's not doing anything else dangerous. Right. Be. Was he able to keep on wearing shorts? Yep. Oh, good. I, I, I get. It. I wear shorts. Uh, you don't run in. You don't run in snowstorms, dear. No, I don't. But I get. I get. You know, people are like, "Dude, aren't you cold?" I'm like, "No, man. I, it's so easy to work in shorts. So much easier. So long as you're constantly moving, yeah, it's fine. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Like I can't stand air conditioners. Ooh. Where I work, where I work, there's there's air conditioners because it's a big store and you know people it gets hot and you got to keep balancing it out with the fridges, otherwise fridges get all frosty. But uh, that's that's what makes me sick is the damn air conditioner in the middle of winter, in the middle of summer. I'm wearing a sweater. Right. Like, so what do you want if you go back to work? Are you gonna go if if, if and when? If and when? I should when? Say, when? When? Are you going back to exactly what you're doing before? Are you gonna try something different? What, what no, are you gonna do? Nothing else to do different. I'm no, a I don't know. I'm a cashier at a convenience store slash gas station. So right. I'm the one who's telling you, put your card in properly or right, come right. pay the gas first right. or, you know, hang up the damn pump, put out your cigarette. No, you well, the, reason, the reason I asked you that, because I don't know, are you going to be able to stand? I mean, look, I, I just, I'm looking out for you. Are you going to be able I am to stand? Working to, to be able to stand. There you go. That's what I was trying to get at. This is, this is what I do, you know, and I can't not do it. I need to have human interaction. Sitting here talking to the dog and a cat all day long and my husband every so often, it just doesn't cut it, right? So right. That's, why, that's why I give you Facebook messages. Like, George! So you and I, okay, this is where we're the opposite. You can see, I love my me time. Love my family. I love oh, my I family. do. I do love my dad. But I've been, you, I have been off since June the 3rd. <laughs> I have not worked. Man, like nine months. Mm-hmm. It's a long time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and depending on when I get the stupid uh, uh, ultrasound test done, it could be yeah. another three to six months wait for that. So that's. Ugh. Well, I'll tell you. you know, but in the meantime, I'm still doing my physical therapy, even though yeah. it's considered torture as far as I'm concerned. Well, I tell you, you look great because I was. And, even, I, was and I haven't eating. gained any weight, but I am eating chocolate like a mad woman. <laughs> Are you really? See, that would be my issue. I would gain. I would gain so much weight. It would. I would just. 
Mm-hmm. I'd have donuts every day. I would be sucking down sprinkled pancakes. Yeah, but the thing is, there's a difference. You see, you can drive to the store and get this shit. That's I can't true. drive. You know? Uh, I'd be that's like, true. honey, I want chocolate. He'd be like, oh, you think you've had enough? <laughs> like, so I'll go find his stash of cakes. Well, where do you live? Where do you live in Canada? How close are you say the village and stuff? I, I, look, I'm not trying to be a smart ass. Don't be a smart ass. I don't care. No, I, I'm just picturing the whole thing. That, okay, it's very cold. There's a lot of snow. You live in your place. And I'm picturing like, how close are the stores? And I'm thinking there's four feet of snow. How the hell do you get there? I mean, you walk. You... Where it's not been snow plowed. Okay. okay. The streets are plowed. We we do have streets. We don't have snow plows. We do have the big bus that runs, runs from my little bird to the big city. Um, hold on. Ashley says something in the chat room. You are visiting my kiosk to get warm, and I am visiting you in the store to keep cool. Purchase slush and don't die of heat and humidity. Yes. Ashley, I met Ashley because there was a, a strawberry kiosk because uh, the farmers have um, strawberries. And they sell it outside the kiosk at our store. And that's mm-hmm. how I met Ashley. She was selling strawberries. And some of my customers were being asshats. And I went and deal with them. And then she was like dying of thirst. I would bring her out slushies. I would <laughs> buy them. Ooh, that sounds <laughs> good. Her. I was nuts. But then I could go out there and steal a strawberry or two. So I get away with that stuff too. <laughs> right. No, no, no. Oh, strawberries are so good. Especially those slushy things of those power drinks with whatever they're called. Uh, it's some type of like slurpee? fruit drink. Yes, that's the one. That's yeah, but no, I I live about a forty five minute walk from the nearest store. Wow. Okay, wow. which is not so bad when you're healthy and you you can walk it. But when you can't walk it, you need a car. I mean, it's only like a ten minute drive max. Right. You know, no, no, my no. grocery yeah. my grocery store is fifteen minutes fifteen minutes away by car. Right. But like I said, when, do, when, do, when does all the snow disappear? You say right around March. <sighs> I'm hoping March April. I think and then, we had some then, last in May. And then Depends what happens? How much, and oh. then, then it's spring-ish, and then it's summer-ish, and then it's fall-ish, and then it's, that's all the fuck over again. Well, how hot does it get there? I mean, it's 70s and 80s and 90s? I think we've gotten to like, the, we've gotten to 25, 30 degrees Celsius, which is about 90 Fahrenheit. Wow, that's good. Yeah. That's solid. You know, we, can, solid. we can get, we can have nice numbers. Those are good numbers. Those, that's what George likes. George likes those 90s. Yeah. That's good stuff, man. But I mean, it's it's you know I love because see where I am, it's country. Mm-hmm. I'll, what I'll do is when we're not on the air, I'll give you my address and you can do a Google search. Oh, I will do a, you know, a Google will. Maps and you can yeah. see where I am. It'll get. I think the I think the Google Map is is in the summertime, so which is cool. Right. But it's 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 a great place to live. Let's put this thing. My daughter, when we lived in the city. My daughter came in and said, Mommy, I learned how to count. One F-bomb, two F-bomb, three F-bomb. I was like, seriously? Because we lived in an apartment complex, and the two of them faced each other, and the kids were playing hide-and-go-seek. Right. They would count to 10, but put the F-bomb word in between each number. So my daughter was about, like, you know, full four years old. And I think, yeah, and, and she was like, she came in. She was so proud that she could count. And I was like, okay, we're moving. My mother lived up here full time. So we came up here, looked for a place. My husband's a city boy, born and raised in Philly. And he was like, I'm not moving up with the bears and the snakes and the, you know, and the wolves and the coyotes. And I was like, I haven't seen a bear. Actually, they did see a bear uh-huh. once. And they saw, uh, we see deer. Uh, we hear the wolves and the coyotes. Wow. Yeah, uh, wolves out there, real wolves? The yeah, wolves. wolves. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And we smell some skunks and smell a couple of foxes. Wow, how big are the wolves out there? Pretty big. Have you ever seen I don't know. Seen I ha- I haven't seen them. Wow, that'd be crazy. Yeah. You know, there's a picture of you. I the think worst. The worst for me is the raccoons. Are they badasses? They are bad. Well, first off, raccoons don't make saliva. So if you leave food out, make sure they got water. Okay. That's why they go for all the juicy stuff because they don't make saliva. That's why you see raccoons. They put their hands in the water because they gotta. Eh. That makes mm-hmm. sense. Uh, th- there was a picture you brought. <laughs> You brought up your daughter a couple of seconds ago. Is the picture of you and your daughter where she's giving you a kiss on the cheek? Is that your daughter? Yep. It's a picture. She is. She has. I'm gonna say this with respect. She has gorgeous skin color. She does. She does. Beautiful skin color. I mean, she's just just amazing, good looking. Uh, I'll I'll give you the picture of her. Uh, the one picture that she has that I that I have that um, uh, she did when she was modeling. Wow. 
Yeah, she's a knockout. She looks great. She's, she, hello, she's my daughter. <laughs> oh, you know, yeah. You know, I want Mama D's. I want Mama D's head to get like this. <laughs> Yeah, no, but my children, my children are, 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 are the bane of my existence, but the loves of my life. Yeah. That you know, sense. and, and children can drive you crazy, but, oh God, yeah. but you know, what goes around comes around because I drove my parents round a bend so many times. It ain't funny. And I drove mine back crazy, back crazy. It's just my turn now. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah. Ashley says, we live in a natural setting, very forested with waterfalls and green spaces. It's a nice choice to live in a country. Winter population, 11,000. Doubles or triples in the summer with tourists and summer residents. Wow. Yeah. Uh, that's, good. Are, that, that's good for the community when it triples. Yeah. Doubles or triples. That's awesome. And we are a community here. It makes it special. Lots of events and stuff to do and get out and get involved. And this this is what Ashley does. She She hosts events. Uh -huh. Not paranormal, but right. she anything anything to do with artists artists artists, she uh -huh. hosts it. Uh, anything that goes for sale, in in her events are all people who make their own stuff. Oh, kind of like those fairs, the outdoor fairs or something yeah, like that. Yeah, exactly. But we she's she's lucky enough to get the the use of a school, and oh, we awesome. also do them outside. Um, I did some work with her last for Christmas, and she had a blast with me. I had her laughing. Of course, right? And she's inviting me to help her again on St. Patty's Day. So I'm going to have to get my nails done in green. Right, you know, right, I'm going to have to yeah. wear those green booty bottle of things. And, and of course, it's all going to go well with this lovely red hair. So <laughs> Lovely, baby. Lovely. Yes. That's, and then that's I want to get her. To, I want to do. I'm going to try. Going to try to get her to do a live with me at the St. Patty's Day event. Because we, we have. When is, when is St. Patty's Day? When is that? March 17th is our event, March. actually. Okay. No, and yeah, and so cool. it it's fun, you know. And yeah. she holds she she does about two or three a year, if not more, you know. And it's like, okay, I'm gonna help you. I'm bored, but I'm gonna help you. It's gonna drive you crazy the whole time, you know. <laughs> no, I hope that you guys go live. I would love to see. I just love seeing new faces. It's it's just like you said, if it's you and Ashley, that's badass. That's gonna be oh, so yeah. much fun. But the thing is, she says she's shy. She's not. She ain't shy. Man, there's no such thing. Not with me anyway. <laughs> not, not with Mama D in the house. Don't let <laughs> people get shy. No. no but you know what? We're, we're past our time. Yes. And, and your boss lady going to be coming home soon. Are you still talking to those people? No, <laughs> hell no. The only thing I'm doing right now is getting my dinner. I got to get my grub on because I'm hungry. That's about it. Well, that's yeah. true. You you came you came rushing home from from work and and you sat down. Is like I'm starving, but I'll talk with you for an hour, D. Oh, I talk to you, girl. I had to because I needed it. I needed to have a little bit. Of, that's gonna sound mad. I I had to have a little bit of mommy. mommy. There you go. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. All right, cool. Well, then next Wednesday again. Next Wednesday again. Yes, sure. yes. Seventeenth is St. Patrick's. We have an event on the fifteenth. And she's been doing six events a year, and she reduced it to three this year. But she didn't have me before, so now she got me. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a bad. That's gonna be so much fun, Ashley. You're a lucky lady. Yeah, because I tour. I know half. I know half the, the 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 village because of where I work. I've been working at the same place for you know almost seventeen years. Right. So everybody knows that, who I am. So when they come in and they start being smart ass, I can mouth off to them, and they still love me. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. All right, girls. Well, then All I right. Am. Well, you have a great night and you go too. enjoy your food. Give I Kara will. a big fat hug for me. I and will. we'll see you next week. I'll talk to you tomorrow. All I know right. I will. Good night. I know. All right. Good night. Bye, everybody. Bye -bye. Thanks for coming. And